Hello, Tiger students. I'm Alani. And I'm Bella. And this is Tiger, Tiger News. News. Today is January 29th. And I hope you guys had a great weekend. And now on to weather with Caroline. And here's the weather and some exciting events for this week. First up, today we had a two-hour delay due to two inches of snow falling over the night. Then, Friday the 2nd is Groundhog Day. The groundhog will decide if we have an extra six weeks of winter or if spring comes early. Then the high for this week is 40 and the low is 19, and it will be mostly cloudy this week. In this Saturday, the sun will start setting later at around 5 p.m. And now on to sports with Aya. Thanks for the send off, Lonnie and Bella. Good morning, tennis students. My name is Aya, and today we are brought to you by Tiger News. Now, let's talk sports. To kick, to kick us off, the boys' varsity basketball team has a game versus Central Catholic at 7 p.m. tonight. Tomorrow night, the girls' varsity gymnastics team have a, have a meet versus high, Haverhill High School at 7 p.m. Wednesday night, the girls' freshman basketball team have, have a game versus North Andover High School at 5 p.m. On Thursday, February 1st, there are no ongoing games, so I hope you athletes all have a good time, like, like rest well. Um, lastly, on Friday, the boys' junior varsity team have a game versus Tewksbury Memorial High School at 5 p.m. Finally, a huge shout-out and congratulations goes out to Sam Field for making 1,000 points in her career for the Methuen High School girls varsity team. Did you guys catch the Chiefs vs. Ravens and Lions vs. 49ers game last night? The score for the Chiefs vs. Ravens game was 17-10, to taking the Chiefs to the Super Bowl again this year, going for their second win in a row. The score for the 49ers vs. Lions game is 31-34. Although the game was very tight, in the end, the 49ers ended up with the win and taking themselves to the Super Bowl versus the Chiefs. Fun fact, did you know that there are more than 8,000 sports played worldwide? Despite this, there are only 33 sports played in the Olympics as of 2021 in Tokyo. Anyway, thanks for tuning in. This is Aya signing off. Thank you, Aya. And now on to Alyssa with upcoming events. Good morning, Tenny students. It's me, Alyssa Machado, and you're watching School News. This week here at the Tenny, we have a few after-school activities. Starting off with National Junior Honor Society today from 2.30 to 3.30. Tomorrow, there's a peer leaders meeting from 2.45 to 3.30. This Wednesday, there's an academic bowl meeting from 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. at the Tenny. Also, make sure you go watch the new Carnations video. It's pretty fire. That's all the upcoming news, Tenny students. I'll see you again next week. I hope you have an outstanding week here at the Tenny. Alyssa Machado, signing off. Thank you, Alyssa. And now on to Hot Topics and Fashion with Gabe. Hi, it's Gabriel Oliveira, and this week I'm going to talk about some hot topics and some new fashion trends. We got a new look at the SpongeBob and Patrick Crocs coming out. We also got an official look at the Kobe 8 Pro Tro's Radiant Emerald, set to release for $190 somewhat this year. There's also rumors of the Black Hat Jordan 5s set to release sometime this year, too. Now let's move on to some hot topics. Tiger Woods' pa partnership with Nike fell apart to the fact that Nike shoes were no longer the right fit for his feet. And Dior made, has made a new spot in Dubai, which price range for one massage is $1,060. That's it for fashion and hot topics.